for most Australians, the only time they'll ever see a dog racing would be a greyhound tearing around a fairly bland oval track. And I suppose you could say once you've seen that, well, you've seen it. But there's a new type of dog racing in Australia now called lure coursing, where not only do the dogs follow a fascinatingly different track, but in fact they use almost every dog breed. And today, we're actually racing, amongst other things, Jack Russell Terriers. It's sort of non-racist racing, isn't it, in that you allow all sorts of breeds in? Yeah, well, our particular club is uh, really the only type of its kind in the world that I know of. Uh, we allow anybody that has a dog that wants to play can, be it a uh, registered breed with uh, one of the controlling bodies or something they picked up from town. Uh, the whole club is set up as a big family, which uh, really gives everybody enjoyment. I'm sure you would have found that walking around today. I've only been twice and each time it's been great fun. For the dogs too. What sort of dogs are you racing? Fox Terriers. Best dogs in the whole world, as you know. Yes. <laughs> oh, a good family day, good for the dogs. They like their um, hamburgers. <laughs> I've heard a rumour that these are the champions, the whippers. Definitely. Definitely yeah. true. <laughs> Why are they better than even greyhounds? Um, well, at, at little coursing they are better than greyhounds because they're small and they can handle the course a lot easier, I think. Do they obviously enjoy it? They do, as you can see. <laughs> she loves it. When we started, we had, I think, eight Afghans. We went into deer hounds. We got a standard poodle, a fox terrier, a Labrador, and that was oh, it's about two Ridgebacks. Right. What about now? Now we get upwards of 100 dogs. Last month we had 120, this month it's 100. So we, we're growing, we're growing. And I'm trying to educate everyone to please send their entries early. Maybe you can put that in. Because <laughs> the chaos in the morning is unbelievable. All right, first off, I'd like to welcome everybody today. The course today is over 300 meters. It's a crossover course again. The Afghans are on first, as always next. Everybody have a wonderful day. There are some breeds that you would never expect to be at something like this. For instance, Basset Hounds. Uh, well, a lot of people wouldn't, uh, but we've had on the, about 35 different breeds so far that have run out here uh, anything from a little papillon that was blind in one eye actually uh right up to the irish wolfhounds which is the largest of the sighthounds so you know nothing really surprised me anymore the main thing is that the people come out they bring out their pet uh the pet runs the people have fun the pet enjoys itself and uh everybody has a good time i noticed the um, basset hound by the end was looking pretty knackered pretty knackered yes but uh had a smile on his face i could tell he lifted the side lips <laughs> <laughs> How did you feel when some of these tiny little breeds that don't run very fast first lobbed? <laughs> well, I've got Pekingese and I know mine would run, but I don't bring them because my Afghans and Peaks have to live together and I don't want my Afghans to think the Pekingese are the lure. So I don't, I don't bring that. But I'm not surprised because little things like this, they rat. Um, my peaks will chase a rat, a, cat, a mouse or something like that. So, you know, little breeds running, it doesn't surprise me because they'll all chase. If anything moves, any dog will chase it. If they don't, there's something wrong with the dog. Is there any breed that shouldn't be brought along to a day like this? No, no. Any breed imaginable can compete. Have you ever had a bulldog come along? No, we've never had a bulldog, but we've had a bulldog breeder come and he was, he was absolutely astonished. He couldn't believe it. So maybe one day we'll get him out here with an Italian greyhounds and his bulldog. Go! Come here. Would you argue that you have the happiest, best-adjusted dogs? I reckon we have. I reckon we have. <laughs>